The weather's on the change this weekend. It's still going to be warm, but we're increasing the humidity. And with more moisture comes the likelihood of more showers and thunderstorms. Why the change? Well, the bigger picture shows high pressure that's been dominating is shifting away. And here comes an area of low pressure, just ambling towards the UK, introducing that change, introducing more moisture, bringing with it air from the Atlantic. So turning more humid, but staying pretty warm, both by uh, day, but particularly by night. And with that increased moisture, there will be more cloud around and an increasing chance of thundery showers. Why the shift? Well, the jet stream is kind of responsible. For a while now, the jet stream's been to the north, but this arm to the south has been intensifying. It's still not particularly strong, hence why this low is not particularly intense. It's what we call a fairly flabby low. There's not a lot of isobars springing out of it. We're not talking about strong winds this weekend, but it is bringing that moisture and that shift in wind direction means that we will see, as I say, an increasing chance of showers and thunderstorms. That happens really during Friday evening by Saturday morning, the greatest risk of showers for Northern Ireland and uh, parts of the southwest of Scotland, but also for a time across the southeast. And then through the day, it'll be in the west, mostly where we'll see the showers. But even here, it's no guarantee that you're going to see a torrential downpour. But where they do occur, they'll drop a lot of rain in a short space of time. Lots of lightning flashes, even large hailstones. Now, many central and eastern parts won't see the downpours at all on Saturday, just staying fine and still pretty warm. And yes, temperatures will still be on the high side, not as high as they've been for much of this week. But in the east, actually, temperatures will be rising a little bit. So it will feel a bit warmer here. And even in the west, even though temperatures won't be as high, it is going to feel very warm and humid. It'll be a difficult night for sleeping then on Saturday night and into Sunday as the low gets ever closer, still introducing more and more of that warmth and humidity across the UK. Now, again, exactly where we see the downpours on Sunday, hard to say at this range. Make sure you stay up to date with the forecast if you've got plans for Sunday. But a greater risk more widely across the country is what we can say. Northern Scotland may well be the one spot that stays completely dry. But even further south and west, again, it's not going to rain in some locations. And even where we've got the showers, they're certainly not expected to last all day. On Sunday, though, there is also the potential for thundery showers to come up from France to affect the southeast of England also. So, yeah, plenty going on through the weekend all the while staying pretty warm and humid, even though temperatures uh, won't be as high as they were early in the week. Perhaps on Sunday with a bit more sunshine, they could be back up into the high 20s across the south and the east. So a warm and a humid weekend to come. Keep up to date with the very latest. Keep track of the rain yourself by downloading an app and then you can watch it on the radar. And of course, we'll have updates throughout the weekend across social media.